Welcome back to The Breakdown. So I came across this video that was posted two hours ago on Tiffany Henyard's Facebook. We have already confirmed at this moment that she's not been arrested, she's not in custody, neither has or is Andrew Holmes. But let's go ahead and watch this video and see what's popping. Come on in, come on in. Come on. Sorry, I don't know how to work Facebook. I don't be on here. Hold on. <laughs> And it's gorgeous outside. Oh, oh my God. It's beautiful. Come on in, guys. Come on in. So, um, I'm going to be really brief. But I want to come on here just to educate the public, the world, that I'm okay. Thank you guys for all your calls, all your concerns. And it saddens me because people will do anything, anything just to get a click a view get right can i just say oh my gosh she looks bad <sighs> i told you get your makeup done every day just in case hold on let me make sure my microphone is on yes it is honey get your makeup done every day every day i don't care you going to jail anyway honey Get your makeup done every day because that's not what you want to look like in your mugshot. Okay, baby? You're not naturally beautiful. Let me just tell you. In case your mama hadn't, you look like her. Okay? Look at her. Okay? You need to. I'm, I'm glad you're getting facials. I see you're getting some microdermabrasion. I see they're throwing some Botox in there. You got some fillers. Very good. I know you got a boob job. I know you got some work done. But there are some things that. You just can't do naturally, honey. You're gonna, you're gonna have to get some makeup done every day. Things, things of that nature. Anything. So I'm here to tell y'all that I'm okay. I have not been in anybody's custody. Um, people got this little fake news out there, and I've tried to tell you guys what I've been dealing with for the last couple of months. People saying all these negative things, false allegations, and I just wanted to let you guys put your eyes on me and let you see that I am okay and that it's all false, it's all fake. And uh, with that being said, I will be um, suing uh, the individual that put that fake news out there. And that's again, I'm going to re restate why I keep telling y'all stop believing the fake news. Everything that's. Well, I mean, your lawyers aren't that smart, so let me tell you, you can't really sue anybody for putting a blog out, okay? They use protective language, reportedly, apparently. I talked about that. That's blog tabloid language. That's how they protect themselves, honey. You are going to spend money hiring an attorney and you are going to waste your time because you can't sue a blog for writing a bloggy story. I called it what the fuck it was. Going on is political, as you guys can see. Um, they drag me left to right. They blame me for everything possible. Uh, it's a three-legged dog. Walk across the street. Up is still fault. Just everything. So I just want y'all to see it for what it is. But I'm just sick and tired of the fake news. And that's all I'm trying to show the public, educate the public on fake news. Do your research before you guys start uh, tuning in to the dumb stuff. But thank you again. I love y'all and ain't nothing you can do about it. And yeah, I even love the hateful. So thank you so much for just calling me and checking on me and making sure I'm okay. Yes, I am okay, guys. Thank you again. Share the video. Let everybody know that your super mirror is a-okay. But I will be suing the individuals putting out all this fake news for clickbait or for ratings and views. So um, stay tuned because Truth Speaks is coming out. Thank you. But Truth Speaks hasn't come out yet. So as of right now, we can assume everything she's saying or said is a lie, except for the fact that she has not been arrested because a, more, a source more credible than her, whose body language says he has every intention of protecting her, okay, whose shifty eyes tell me that he is going to protect his Tiffany Henyard, and so is he going to protect his Andrew Holmes over his people. He is going to protect them. Anyway, it's obvious she hasn't been arrested, y'all. <sighs> Watch the fucking rumors. I almost think she planted that story. I'm going to be honest with you. I honestly think that she contacted Sister Good, Do Good or in some way, shape, or form planted that story to detract us from the story about the three people who are suing her. 
and the Illinois Human Rights Commission investigation against her and Andrew Holmes. Anyway, per usual, that's all I got. Ain't got no more. <laughs> I holla.